Breaking overnight, fierce flames shooting from a home in Newton, causing part of it to collapse while crews were inside. The bitter cold making it even harder for firefighters on scene. Let's get right out to Michelle Fisher there with the latest for us. Michelle. Well, Chris and Kate, those firefighters finally starting to wrap up. They've been here on Cook Street for over four hours after this fire. Take a look at the roof. You can see that part of it completely collapsed into the attic and third floor, even raining down on firefighters that were inside at the time. Now, here's a look at some video from earlier. Intense flames shooting from the roof at one point. A neighbor that was passing by called 911 around 1.30 this morning. Now, this home is a two-family home. Right now, though, only one side occupied. The person who lives there was making his way out of the burning home as crews were making their way in. That included firefighters from both Newton and Brookline. They started an aggressive interior attack, made their way up to the second floor bedroom. The ceiling above them collapsed down, rained down fire around them. Now, here's a look at steps that are leading up to the second floor of the home that burned. I wanted you to take a look at how icy they are. Firefighters say that is one of the things they had to deal with, ice, in addition to frozen fire hydrants. Now, despite the roof collapsing and the icy conditions, firefighters are all safe this morning, and the person that lives inside is safe as well. Right now, the cause of this fire still under investigation. Reporting live in Newton, I'm Michelle Fisher for WBC This Morning.